Welcome to another edition of a help video for Launchpad. Today we're going to talk about how you can add an app to your Launchpad. And an, an app that you may want to add to your Launchpad might be Google Drive. So instead of always having your, your student email open, um, you can also have um, an app here for your drive. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and go up to our tools. You can see that there are lots of different tools here. You can keep notes, you can look for help, there's a home button, There's you can create folders in your launch pad as well. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to click on the edit mode which is going to allow us to add an app. So we want to add a new app so we're going to click on new app and it's going to take us to the resource library and I'm going to go ahead and do a search and here you can do all kinds of um, apps onto your launch pad okay anything remember that has a key is something that's going to need a login and a password so if you don't have an account say for discovery education you can't load that app into your um, launch pad okay so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to search for Google Drive and I'm going to go ahead and um, add this app to my launch pad. And it says that it has um, added successfully. Okay, so once we have the app added, we can go ahead and close that part. So you just click on that X in the upper right hand corner. And now you can see that Google Drive is here. So then all you have to do if you're done editing, you can click done editing. Okay, then we click on Google Drive and it's going to ask you to log in. Okay, so we we'll just go ahead and you will go ahead and put in your student email address and your password and you'll go ahead and sign in. Then Launchpad should remember your login and your password and then you will have Google Drive all set and ready to go. So that's a quick tutorial on how to add an app to your launch pad. If it requires sign-in information, you go ahead and put that in. Launchpad will save that information for you and you will be good to go. Again, if you have any questions or having um, any difficulty with adding an app um, or getting that information, Set. We do have an inf um, information video on how to set up your locker in the settings area to save those logins and passwords. And you can always give the help desk a call. So thank you.